Hello friends and assalamu alaikum welcome to my channel i be all designing developer like in the previous videos we have covered up many of the things using different languages and i hope you enjoy that all stuff which we have done here so today we are also doing an amazing project using react 18 because previously on you all know that we have covered up many of the projects using react 18 so today basically i will be telling you that how to just build this amazing project using react 18 and i hope you will be enjoying and understanding today's video as well so remember to see our today's video from start to end because it will be giving you help if you want to and like how to just use uh, uh, means how to just use react editing from start to end so today in this video i will be telling you that how you can use pages and next step to just build our project i'll be telling you what are the pages and how you can use it using next step uh, and what is our next step after using that pages so i will be giving you whole briefing about this project of react 18 i hope you will be understanding this video and it will be helpful for you so if it is helpful for you and you are learning things from this video so hit a like and if you are new on this channel hit the subscribe button after subscribing it notification bell as well so more people can learn and they can understand these all stuff which you are understanding and i hope you will be seeing that all videos in future as well which will be giving you help moving forward so today like i'm telling you we'll be just building an amazing project of like this uh you can say this amazing project of pages and next steps so now we'll be starting with this and we'll be seeing that how we can use this tag here and what will the things we'll be using in this tag from start to end so just now we'll be starting with our today's video but before that you can also check my previous videos which i have covered up because that will giving you help like from start to end we have covered up many of the react 18 videos from in the starting i've telling you how to create react folder how to start your own react app like that so you can check that video out because that will also giving you help if you want to learn that things so now we'll be starting with our video and basically seeing that how we can use pages and next step as our tag in react 18 from start today we'll be working with react 18 and basically i'll be telling you that how you can just build this amazing project of react 18 and today we'll be learning about pages and next step in react 18 like what is this and how you can use this pages and next step in react 18 when you want to use and how you can work with this so for building this amazing project of pages and next step here you have to open your vs code and after opening the vs code here you have to close all the folders and files which you have opened make a new window here then I will be opening my folder from which we will be working with our React 18 which is app1 folder so I will be opening it through my local deck C because we have created there. Now I will be running this command of React 18 by writing the command of npm start which is the command to run our React 18 or React or React JS app. So this is our two main file which is app.js and second one is app.css so I will be moving through these two files. Then I'll be raising all the stuff from this file. In the previous video, we have learned about link tag. So that were the codes of that video. I have erased that because we'll be not needing in today's video. Then this is the title which we have given. So I will be changing the title as well because today we are learning about pages and next steps. So here I will be writing the title of pages and next step like this. Save it. Now we have also changed the title here. So when it will be opening in our default browser, so we'll be getting our title here written. So it will be opening on our default Microsoft Edge browser because I have made Microsoft Edge as my default browser for working with React, React JS or Next.js. So now it is taking some loading and opening it. So I will be doing it side by side here. You can see we are getting the command of a starting development server. Now it will be giving us the, uh, you can say option that success successfully compiled here. If, if it is not having any error means if this browser is not having any error or it is working you can see now it has been run so we are getting our title and then we are also getting the same command webpack compile successfully means there is not having any error in this server so we can work with this so i'll be closing this terminal now because now we'll be not needing this so now here you can just start your main codes about today's video so like i'm telling you in today's video we'll be learning about pages and next steps so i'll be telling you that how you can create different pages here so for creating different pages here you have to now just write a tag here so after writing this i will be now just creating the tag which should be like root so you will be using this root tag here if you want to just create different pages so here i will be writing root path so here i will be writing this is a way of path so here i will be now writing this say you can see we are getting this it is saying route is not defined so you can just import this route from the top if you want to import but i will be not importing it directly from here so you can create different you can just link different pages from this pages file and then you can move on to the next step here so for just linking the pages you have to just write the command so the command for linking the pages is that if you just create this and if i just write the command of like animation so in animation command you can run your project here so i will be uh, pressing ctrl z to just 
remove that all stuff because today we are learning about pages and next step so you can create different pages here so for creating pages you can use hr line here so if i write this hr and after writing this hr if i just do one thing like if i save it you can see you will be getting one hr line means this is the page line which we are getting here so you can just copy and paste this page line so it will be easy for you to define so here paste it then paste it you can see these are the hr lines which we are getting which helps the user to make different pages here so you can use this hr line many times in your pages here so it can be styled say you can see many of the hr lines has been here so you can just create this hr line in whole of your page here if you want to create because it will be giving help to the user if they want to just work and if they want that their uh you can say page should be with the pages you can see these this is the different thing which we are getting here you can also uh, make this thing like pattern like if i make here and if i just write here hr hr again this time so you will be getting many of the hr tag and you can see this these are the hr lines which we are getting so you can just give the background color to your background and then you will be getting different color in different lines mean that this is the different pages which we have created and you can do it using pages and next step so i will be moving on to this app.css file now after moving to this file if i want to give any color so i will be writing here background should be crimson so i'll be writing this say like where i've just given this crimson color to my background you can see this line has been changed into white and our background has been changed into crimson color which is looking awesome you can see it is like pattern thing which we are getting on our page so like this you can use pages uh, you can use pages and next step so here now i've telling you like how you can use this all stuff you can also change the color of hr line which you are getting you can change into black or any other color if you want to do that like if i write if i write here background of hr should be black so you can write triple zero which is the color code of black you have to save it from here and then after saving this you have to reload to check it is working you can see the background is not changing because we have just written hr here so i will be now saving it and after saving just you have to reload so this this is the thing which i want to show you like this you can change the color of your hr line as well you can also set your hr line by giving its width or height by your own self so you can see we are getting this hr lines here you can give different colors to your hr line using this pages and next step like if i move on to my app.js file again first of all i'll be saving on this file then moving to app.js file again here i will be raising all the codes which we are getting of hr and if i want to just give any of the other effect on my page so you can just use some of the other tag as well because there are many of the tags to give effect here to your tags or anything like that so if i just move here and then if i just write a tag which should be like this thing and then i will be now just writing like uh, you can say this is the thing which we have written so if i write this input box here and after writing this input here i will be writing type is equals to and in the type if i write here uh, like you can say this color after writing this color if i just now close this input box like this and then after closing just i'll be raising this close tag so save it here you can see we are getting the color tag and from here you can change the color of your text you can see this you can change the color of your text you can change the color of your background but for that you have to put the codes of javascript so you can work with this but we'll be not putting any code just i want to show you that how you can use this color tag as well to just give color to any other object you want to give to so like this you can just use so i hope you understand what are pages and next step which we used in react 18 and i hope you understand this video if you understand enjoy this video so hit a like and if you're new on this channel hit the subscribe button after subscribing hit notification bell as well if you want to see more videos related to react 18 you can also suggest me in the comments what project should i made using react 18 and what language tutorial should i cover when I'm working with React Ready and moving forward, I'm also building big videos. You can check that or I've built many of the projects also because that will giving help to a user if they want to learn that all stuff and they want to build their own projects here. So just now we'll be starting with our uh, big projects in future. So today we'll be now, uh, I will be meeting the next project with more amazing things using React Ready. So for today, good bye.